All right, we are talking about uh, switching to summer beauty routines as we prepare for that hotter weather. So Desiree is live with us for more on this. Uh, Desiree, you know, when the temperature comes climbing up, your makeup seems like it just starts falling off your face. <laughs> I, I have such a hard time. It just melts. Yeah. Yeah, it just melts. So we're talking about some new trends. We're here at the Sparkle Bar uh, in Old Town Scottsdale. So come on in and take a look. It's beautiful in here. I wish you could smell it. It smells great, too. Look at these gorgeous girls. They don't need any makeup. They're the daughters of the owner, Alex Bradbury, uh, who we're meeting here, who is going to show us some of the trends that we're talking about for this summer, tinted moisturizer. Um, so, so what do we need to know? We're so excited to be getting out and about again. It's a beautiful day and the, the temperatures are definitely heating up. So we've got some they easy are. tips and tricks for you okay. to create a look that is super wearable, especially since we're starting to reemerge. That's easy to pair with a mask. And even if you don't have a tinted moisturizer at home, we're gonna show you how with a couple items from your own medicine cabinet, you can mm -hmm. do this. Okay. Here's Eli, he's our studio manager and artist extraordinaire with Dulce, our beautiful model. We're just gonna show you exactly how you can layer um, a sunscreen that you might have at home with a concealer and a moisturizer to blend it to perfection. Okay, so you just took what, moisturizer? I took a little bit of sunscreen. So this sunscreen okay. is by Algenis, which is an amazing brand, super lightweight, doesn't have any flashback to it. As you might uh, not know, SPF can cause a flashback in photography. So what's great is Algenis has taken this and flattened out that SPF, so it's nice and sheer so we don't get this white cast on Dulce's gorgeous yellow golden skin tone. And you see how that just gives her nice coverage, a little mm -hmm. bit of glow, mm -hmm. but it's not like in your face, so she can still pop on her mask and enjoy her day and then still be protected. So do we have to find the right SPF though? Because I have some at home and it's kind of greasy, shiny. So I think if I mix that with foundation, you know, it might be too heavy. So is it, what, what's the trick? So there are a lot of different options of sunscreen when it comes to what's available on the market. Some are easy to blend and mix with each other. Mm -hmm. um, we have a couple of different options here, including like brands like Shiseido and Algenis, which make it very easy to blend something that's not going to have that greasy finish. Okay. And then you put this over her entire face. This was her yes, foundation. This, this was her foundation. And she and, looks beautiful. Right. I mean, her, first of all, she has flawless skin, so that's helping. But she's just got a really pretty dewy glow, right. and that's in. It's just hydrating the skin. Hydrating. It's been a long time since a lot of us have been out, and mm -hmm. so we don't need a heavy look. And so this allows you to create something fresh that gives your skin that nice, even complexion that feels hydrated, that's glowing. But and what most are you doing protecting. here? So what we've done is we've taken a little bit of highlighter. This is a liquid highlighter in particular. Um, we also, you can use a powder highlighter as well, but what we've done is mixed it with the sunscreen. And so mm -hmm. as you can see, we've applied it on the decollete and mm -hmm. on the shoulder right here. And it gives this amazing like goddess, like beachy glow mm -hmm. without again, causing that greasiness. But also we okay. are protecting from those like evil sun rays. Right? And quickly, if someone's afraid to mix the two, how do we layer if we do that on our face? So wet dry, just like baking, just okay. like cooking. So you would want to take like Neutrogena makes a great like spray on sunscreen. Mm -hmm. So you spray that on and then you can take like a big kabuki brush, like a big fluffy powder brush like this and okay. just kind of kiss Dust it on. wherever Dust you feel it on. like you want to have that nice okay. beautiful glow. Nice. And here in the sparkle bar, you do makeup. That's Just it. Makeup. You come in, fresh face, or With maybe a little layer complexion. Foundation. But we can take your look from Dust very, to dinner. Right, dust to dinner. Very, very easy. So <laughs> pop in. We can't wait to see you. <laughs> well, she looks absolutely beautiful. So there is your trick for this summer. Mix that SPF with the foundation um, because certainly the harsh rays from the sun, you want to protect your skin. Uh, for now, we'll send it back to you.